Roberta or Charles, whatever you want. Uh, late night, huh? Everyone's really excited. I'm the last one. on my presentation like that. Oh, Charlie, that's why I'm here. It's your presentation. It's been stolen. Who would steal my presentation? Who do you think? Your arch nemesis. Brock Carey? No, you oh. idiot. Your arch nemesis. Art B. Roblins. But, 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 but SBA said I didn't have to deal with them ever. Mm -mm. SBA says a lot of things, Charlie. They say a whole lot of things, but they don't always mean what they say. Now look, we're running out of time. We gotta go. Stop Art. Save your presentation. Come on, let's kick his ass. Doc, Doc, I'd love to kick his ass. You know I would. But where are we going to find him? Well, Charlie, the worst place in the entire world. You don't mean... Well, well, well. It was a Doc Joe James and his dim-witted photo major, Charlie Purdom. How's the presentation going, boys? Not so great. Where's the presentation art? Well, I'm sorry. It's a little bit tied up at the moment. <laughs> ah! Give me back my presentation. I'm sorry. I can't do that, Charles. You see, your pictures, they're, they're too amazing for people to see. They have this kind of eclectic madness that boggles the mind. I'm literally destroying the world by not letting anyone see them. Well, actually, my photos are more about me and my friends hanging out and having a good time. You know, going to bars or going to each other's houses and really spending time together. Because through all my life, I've been worried and I don't have a lot of time to enjoy life. But with my camera, I set out these moments where I can just have a good time. And I do long exposures to capture the entire event. So when I go through these bouts of stress or worrying, I can look back on them and go, hey, there are good times. And you know what, sure, it's not high art, and it's not gonna go into a museum somewhere, but it's really important to me. And you know what? That's all that fucking matters. Well, that's fucking lame. Hey, fuck you! You know what? I don't have time for this. Oh, boys! Take care of them. Pocket damn yeah. bitch! Yeah. 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 Oh, I got this one, Charlie. You take that one. I, I try it. Doc, I got it. I got the presentation. Doc? Well, Charlie, seems like we've reached a little bit of an impasse. Either you give me the presentation, or I kill your friends. Charlie, go, let me die. Look, I care more about this presentation than I do about my own life. Go! You should have ran away when you had the chance! Have fun failing art school, bitch! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Come on, Charlie. 
Come on, let's go. Come on. Sure, let me die back there, Charlie. Yep. What are we gonna do, Doc? My presentation was on that flash drive. Without it, I fucking can't graduate. I should just give up. What? Charlie? Charlie, no, Charlie, you can't give up. If you give up now, You'll undermine all that you've done these past four years. You can't give up. You know why? It's because you've had the presentation inside of you. All along. You just didn't know it. Oh. What you're saying is, this whole adventure was just one big metaphor. <laughs> no, Charlie! I knew you'd fuck up. It was literally inside of you this entire time. It was in your heart, Charlie. It was in your heart this whole time. This entire adventure was pointless. You'd be like my degree? Exactly. Come on, Charlie, let's finish this presentation. 